really not sure. You don't think it's going to happen to you, but here it is. Several schools in Forest Ranch will have extra security tomorrow after the schools were briefly placed on lockdown today because of an anonymous phone threat. There were emotional reunions at both campuses today as parents went to pick up their children. The San Diego Police Department says the anonymous call was made using a Google phone number and threatened a shooting at Del Norte High and a nearby elementary school. In addition, these other schools were also placed on lockdown as a precaution. They included Stone Ranch, Monterey Ridge, and Del Sur Elementary Schools, as well as Oak Valley Middle School and Design 39 and Marantha Christian Schools. Fox 5's Jamie Chambers joins us with how this played out. Heart-stopping moments for so many people in the Forest Ranch area as the San Diego Police Department tweeted out that there was a school threat and several schools were going into lockdown. As the lockdowns lifted, children felt the embrace of traumatized parents. Reeling from the worst mass shooting in a decade, police say an anonymous threat aimed at Del Norte High School from a Google phone triggered all the alarm bells. The teachers, too, they, they didn't even know what was going on. And all of a sudden, it went into a lockdown drill. And all um, and like we had to turn out all the light. Several schools in the Poway School District went into lockdown as well, including Del Sur Elementary. Everybody in was scared, but some of them cried. Parents waiting to pick up their five to eleven year olds were exhausted from the cruelly planted threat. I got a text uh, through San Diego PD and uh, to my cell phone and. I ran right here. I've never seen so many parents like this outside the school. So when I showed up, I was really worried because there was also a helicopter. Just everything these days, everything you see, it's, it's hitting home. Investigators are now trying to identify who made the call, but it's expected to take some time before they have their suspect. All the while, parents are just trying to make sense of a terribly emotional afternoon. Is every parent going to have to go through this to make common sense changes? to prevent this from happening. That's what I think. I mean, do we have to go that far? I don't know, it's very frustrating. We're just happy they're okay and they're back at home and um, that's about it. We're just all happy to be home as a family. Security is expected to be tight on Friday, but speaking with parents, they say they're not sure if they're going to be sending their students to school. So attendance is expected to be light. That's the very latest from Forest Ranch, Jamie Chambers, Fox 5 News.